Hey YouTube, this is Tara and welcome back to my channel. For some reason, I only have 20 minutes to do this video. And let's see, can we get it crack a lacking? Okay, so this is another unboxing or unbagging. Um, Y'all Nails sent me this in the mail. Now, I recently did an unboxing for Y'all Nails. And it had these two products in it. The Ultimate finish gel and it had a little thing inside saying here is your replacement bogo oh finish gel thank you for being a loyal customer and thank you for your patience now I thought this was the bogo because it was two in here But apparently, I bought two of these, and I was supposed to get two free. But it's something else was a BOGO, too. So, I'm, it's that bond, nail bonder, protein bond. I'm going to have to contact them and see if was I was supposed to get another one free. So, I want to share that with you guys. And also, I have some more nail care products. So, this is from Daisy. Okay. So you may have seen these in the salon like years ago. It's called D and D or something like that. Lasts up to 21 days. I'm not for certain, but um I already have um um I think it's called a strawberry set or something that I unboxed like during Thanksgiving, Christmas. That I still haven't used. So that's the first thing in the box. And of course what my granddaughter loves to play with. She call it Pop It. Okay. And let's see what else is in here. So we got a whole tray of nail colors. That I chose myself. They did not send these. Okay. I think these are sets. So... Yeah. The spending habit is real. Okay. Okay. So let's see, can we get these polishes out of these containers without um, actually messing up the setup here? Okay. So right here we have number... Uh oh, we're gonna mess up the setup. We're gonna mess up the setup. Okay, let me see. We're messing up the setup. I want it to sit up so y'all can see. Now that's too much. But we ain't gonna trip. Okay, so the ones that are in the white bottle, these are the gel. If you've ever used this brand before, let me know because it says right there on the bottle, soak off gel, all in one, okay? And we just going to open it and see what color. I'm assuming this is the color, okay? Ooh, ooh. Okay, and then here is the nail lacquer. Okay. And not sure if I can show you side by side without making a mess. Okay, both other caps are the same. 
this is the gel out on the top and this is the regular lacquer nail polish so I'm not sure if that's wise because I don't want to make a mess but if you really want to do like a comparison go back to the video and look again okay okay so here we have the soak off okay and seven six three it may look blue but it's purple oh wow that's pretty this is a pretty dark purple okay that is the gel soak off we're gonna have to do two videos Ooh. Here is the you no know, lacquer seven six three. It looks completely different in the bottle. This look a little darker for some strange odd reason. Okay. A little more plum or wine, if you ask me. And then trying to pop, trying to pop these back in. Here is the soak off. It says three step system. Okay. And this is number seven six five so I think I have my St. Patrick's Day um yeah I definitely have my St. Patrick's Day shade right here won't he do it said he would not that he got anything to do with it but wow that is gorgeous I don't know if the camera is doing it justice but the deep green and the green and the blue glitters and I don't know if the camera is doing it justice but ooh, that is nice let's see what the nail lacquer looks like the nail lacquer is basically just nail polish Number 765. Happy St. Patty's Day. Now see, I was gonna be I was gonna fool with them nail falls. But guess what? Look at that. That is beautiful. That is a beautiful color. So, recently, L. DeBarge and the DeBarge family, if you are familiar with them, their mother passed away. Look at this. Okay, this is number 2534. This is so pretty. And this is supposed to be like a comparison with the Tiffany blue but I doubt it cuz this look like powder blue baby blue Tiffany blue is 
it has a little bit more blue in it than this but yeah this is pretty see when I have my phone facing away from me y'all um it, it tries to focus it tries to oop I dropped something I have to see what that is it tries to focus on its own but when I have it facing me that's not the case. So that's why I like to do the video like this. But unfortunately, hold on. Y'all, my little stand that I had in here is supposed to be my little stand. Let me loosen it. Okay, YouTube, I'm back. So what I did was I just went ahead and stood them all up this way inside of the tray okay so this one right here is two five three four and it's supposed to be the same as tiffany blue but I, that's not what i'm picking up oh y'all picking that up I'm not getting Tiffany blue and I will do like a swatch video um, and okay here we have like this really really pretty lilac this is gonna be two videos cuz I have some more this is two five three two this pretty lavender is coming off as kind of white a little bit on camera but hey Oh man, this is so pretty. This this is pretty. Is it lavender? Can y'all see? I'm ooh, I'm gonna be mad when I go back and look at the video, and this don't look lavender. But I'm gonna have to do a swatch. I'm not sure if I'm gonna swatch the gel polishes. Um, uh, is this the gel? Hmm. That's weird. I'm assuming that this is the gel polish. Because. This is not. And so they was two for six dollars and some change. These was on clearance. And I purchased these from. Um, oh my god, what's the name of that site that sells like, yeah, this is a pretty lavender, this is a nail polish, I hope, yeah, because the nail polishes are in a glass bottle, and the gel polishes are in like a different kind of, like this look like a gold plastic bottle, and it's wrapped in paper. So then we got this beautiful meant to be. And something else I noticed too. This has the, the name on it. Meant to be. And this is a beautiful green. Not sure how it's coming off. And it's not like a leaf green. No. It's not sage. It's actually mint. A light green. Okay. So not sure if we're going to do like a St. Patrick's Day combo. Well we got us a dark green and a light green. But here is the nail polish. They was two for six dollars and some change. And I don't hear people talking about this brand. Meant to be. This is so pretty. Okay. This one was called Barefoot C. Barefoot C. 
Okay, and this one was called Lavender Haze. Okay, this one is a beautiful blue. And it's called Feeling Frosty. Ooh. Feeling Frosty. This is beautiful. Are we going to have us a blue-green moment for St. Patty's Day? Because they were like, why well, you green? So my greens are probably going to be on my nails. I got to hurry up too because my phone is losing charge. It doesn't have and feeling frosty. This is the gel. Oh my God. Look at it. She thick thick. She thick thick. Oh, so if I hold up against that white background, I can bring it forward. It, it can focus. Okay, she cute. Come through. So I have Frosty Feeling or Feeling Frosty. Feeling Frosty. Okay. I have Meant to Be. Lavender Haze, Barefoot Sea, okay, this one is Ice Len, okay, Ultraviolet. And you could probably see the names on them when I did the initial unboxing. And this is called Stormy. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to rate, comment, subscribe. Thumbs up my video. Tell a friend, tell a friend about my channel. I love you for watching till the end. Um, let's get this, um, let's pop this Iceland out, and let's give it another go. It's going to be a part two. So, let's get up close to this white, and then bring it a little closer. So you can really get the effect. Really pretty. Really pretty. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to rate, comment, subscribe. Thumbs up my video. Tell a friend, tell a friend, tell a friend about my channel. I love you for watching to the end.